So right from the CR insert to we talk about the, you know, the medial congruent, medial pivot, anterior stabilized, uh, the deep dish design. So what is your take? How do we decide what kind of, you know, insert to use and do we always need to maintain the PCL when you're using such inserts or do you, you can easily sacrifice it? So uh, I struggle with the same question. So uh, I use most of it is striker. So I have access to the CR and CS insert. Uh, with the aid of technology, even before I do any cuts, I can actually see how the knee is pivoting. Is it medial? Is it is it a dual pivot? Is it a lateral pivot? So the whole procedure, my uh, intention is to recreate it. So I tend to preserve my PCL as much as I can. Uh, but having said that, there has been a shift towards the medial pivot insert. Uh, if I use a medial pivot insert, I would do it without the PCL because I don't want that conflict to happen. I've seen it enough uh, in, uh, in most of the patients where the PCL doesn't behave the way it should. So if I'm using a medial pivot insert, I would let the insert do the job of rollback. And if I'm doing a PCL uh, retaining knee, I would do it with a CR insert.